so this is the second part of my weekly update. Um, I just want to talk because I should be studying. Okay, y'all know that um, I do research and everything. And um, we finally started research, finally, five months later. Um, and we have to use uh, potting soil for our salamanders in our little boxes. And uh, I was setting up the boxes Wednesday and I needed more potting soil. So I went to our greenhouse and got it and it was a 40 pound bag. And <laughs> that thing was so freaking heavy. I could barely lift it. So I, I picked it up and I took it from the greenhouse to my lab and I was huffing and puffing and sweating because it was so freaking heavy. And I, I put it down and I had an epiphany. And you know, I thought, I used to have this on my body. I mean, all of it wasn't concentrated in one place like, you know, the potting soil bag. But I used to have 40 pounds on me like this. And then I thought, whoa, I used to have 80 pounds, two bags of potting soil on me. No wonder I was hot and sweaty. No wonder my legs and feet hurt. No wonder I was huffing and puffing, walking from the car to the mall or a doorway or to school or something like that. That is it's just amazing. It really is. And Two bags of potting soil is gone from my body. I could barely lift one bag, and I was carrying two around on me. This is it's amazing. It really is. So, um, you know, if you've lost 40 pounds, 50 pounds, go to the store and pick up a bag of potting soil. And then you'll, you won't be saying, oh, 40 pounds isn't a lot. You know, I can lose more. 40 pounds is a lot. And you should be so proud of yourself if you've lost 40 pounds. You should be proud of yourself if you've lost 5, 10 pounds. Because losing weight is harder than putting it on. Um, so yeah, that was my epiphany for this week. As you can see, I'm feeling better. Um, I still have a cough. I still have some sniffles, but I'm feeling a whole lot better. And uh, I'm going to start my couch to 5k again this week. Um, not today, because I should be staying. But yeah, um, this week I am going to stop eating after 7pm. I'm noticing that I'm not losing weight from my uh, night weight to my next morning weight. So I'm going to quit eating after 7. And um, I'm going to quit eating stuff out. I'm not eating any Chinese or Mexican or anything like that. I'm only going to eat stuff here at home that I can prepare and measure myself. Um, I'm going to start writing in my uh, little calendar, journal, book, there goes my book, my book thing, recording my calories on Spark People, um, I mean, it's, it's time to start being mindful of what I eat, how much I eat, my calories, and everything like that, um, because you know, I've just now relied on my tool to restrict my eating, um, and I don't eat really bad things. Um, you know, occasionally I'll have chocolate and chips, but you know, I don't, I don't eat all that stuff all that often. But I've noticed the past two weeks that I've been uh, grazing 
and I mean it it's hurting me I know it is um, so I'm gonna try to stick to three meals and two snacks of fruit a day I'm not buying any more chips I'm not buying any more pretzels um, I'm not having any of that junk um, so and I, I think I'm going to go back to the way I used to eat right after surgery, like uh, refried beans and soup and stuff like that. Um, protein shakes. Um, so yeah, I've thought about this all week long. After fitting into my size 12 jeans. Um, I'm... You know, I like it when I'm at a stall and I can tell that I'm losing inches and stuff, but, you know, I know it's just a number on the scale, but I'm ready for it to move. I am, um, you know, I've been in the 190s for a month now, and it's, it's time to go down. Um, and, you know, I wonder if my body has a memory, like in my adult life I've never been below 190 and I cannot get to 190 to save my life I can get to 191 but I I have not seen 190 and I wonder if it's because my body hasn't seen it in my adult life and you know it's freaking out and it's like oh no way you know that's uncharted territory I am not going there screw you I'm staying right here um, so yeah, I'm, I'm just, you know, that, that's popped into my head several times, and, you know, it's making me think, I wonder, seriously, does my body have a memory? So, um, I've got a headache. I just did a series of videos that I'm going to post after I post these. Um, I have a whole lot of new subscribers, <laughs> and um, you know I'm I'm looking forward to knowing each and every one of y'all, and um, I'm so glad you subscribed to my channel. And you know I hope I can be helpful and inspirational to you with your journey and goals. And, um, you know, y'all give me accountability, too. Y'all push me to succeed. Um, and, but, um, my series of videos is about my journey from the very beginning till now. And, um, you know, I, I hope all of my new subscribers watch them because, um, I know you don't want to go back six months ago and start watching all of my videos so um i tried to condense it into three videos <laughs> um but you know like i say at the end of it if you have any questions let me know you know i want to help you i want to be here for you i want to see you succeed and i want to help you succeed um so you know send me a message send me a comment send me a video if you want to know something ask I can be found on Live Journal. I'm Tattooed Girl. I can be uh, found on MySpace. Um, I'm on Yahoo Messenger. Um, and, you know, I'll. It's, you know, YouTube is really wonky here lately. So, uh, you know, if you want my real email address, just message me and ask and I'll give it to you. Um, so, if you want to know any of that, any of my screen names, whatever, let me know, and I'll, you know, I'll give it to you, and I'll be more than happy to get in touch with you, and help you, if I can, or, you know, just listen to you rant, and rave, and bitch, and moan, that's fun, because, you know, I do it too, so, um, yeah, um, I'm really looking forward to this week, and I feel like something's about to happen, but I don't know what. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm kind of looking forward to that. Oh, 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 go see Tommy D's video about meeting up in June. It's going to be awesome.